up here talking about this wacky weather. It's mid-January in central Indiana. You'd never know it. Uh, but the 30s again this morning, so a little cooler. Yeah, a little cooler, but again, still trending warm for this time of year. I like it. Yeah, you know I, I asked, do. I was asked by one of our producers, do you think winter is over? No, not at all. But, I mean, let's take this yeah. and embrace it because we're probably going to have a couple of big snows still coming up, maybe even before March, but not in the near future, which is good. You know, anytime you have weather like this, you sometimes have fog where it's uh, not very windy and it's very damp, but fog really not a big issue, except in Greencastle and Bloomington where visibility is uh, weakening. In fact, at Greencastle, uh, about three hours ago, it was uh, 10 miles and now down to four. So some of you will have fog. I do not think that's going to be a major problem. Earlier this morning, we had not only snowflakes, but some light rain blow through the metro area and most of Indiana. That's now gone, and you can see just a few sprinkles out there, so we're looking pretty good. We're also looking to the south, where this big developing storm from Little Rock down to Houston is going to come together, and we are going to get wet tomorrow night into Friday, but not today. Today we start out cloudy, eventually a high of 44. The average high, by the way, is 35. So 36 already here and 34 in Chicago. Even to the north, do you remember, I guess it was the end of last week, it was 31 below zero in International Falls. They're now more than 50 degrees warmer than that. It's still 25, but that shows you just how cold it was there last week. All right, let's show you what the kids are up against when they go to school today. They're not up against anything weather-wise. It's going to be pretty good. 38 at lunchtime. Coming home, there will be at least a little bit of sunshine and 44. And the IUPUI Jaguars are going to play today. Apparently, no weather at all will occur during that time. <laughs> it's actually going to be in the 40s. Boom, it just kind of no disappeared weather. there. No weather at all. Uh, but it'll be in the 40s and will be dry if you're headed out to the Fairgrounds Coliseum tonight to watch them play. Okay, let's show you how this rain's going to come in. Tomorrow we actually start out uh, clear and dry and beautiful. It'll be sunny, but then very quickly at about 3.30, here comes the rain, and it's going to pour, I think, during the evening rush hour and then some into the wee hours of the morning on Friday, uh, some heavy downpours of rain. There could be standing water for Friday's morning rush hour. Still, in back of this very warm weather that will surge in here for the weekend. So today at 44 will be the coolest day out of the next several. Wednesday could be quite wet, or Thursday afternoon and evening could be quite wet into early Friday morning. Then Saturday and Sunday, fantastic. 62 Saturday, 64 Sunday. And even though more rain coming in next week, we're still well above average until maybe Friday or Saturday of the next week. More on that, Ben and Julia, in minutes. All right.